car. I'm super sorry there's no GoPro for this one and that it's just so bad and then I keep zooming in and I'm so sick and phlegmy and boogies and goodbye, I'm sorry. Bup, 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 bangerang. You should redo your uh, intro. You don't like the... I'm a it's just like, it's, it cuts weirdly. It's How? like, it well, doesn't it sound to. great together. Because it's the actual audio. Yeah. How should I do it then? I don't know, what if you actually just did the whole song yourself because then you don't have to worry about copyright. Anyway. I can't produce, I mean I'd have to get a producer to no. do it. Oh my god, are you kidding me? Literally, all you, all you do can it. do is just do that, put some reverb on it, and you're set. Dude, turn that down. Turn it down? It's gonna make noise on me. Oh what is this, why are you turning around? Your car noises are loud enough! It's a sports car! You could literally just make it, I'm a motherfucking car boy, and then put some reverb on it, and you don't even have I'm to- a I could whip boy. something up in FL Studio for you. Oh, please do that. Cool. I actually did a remix of um, of Starboy when that came out. Really? And I put it on SoundCloud, and they immediately flagged it. Oh no way! On yeah. SoundCloud. They didn't Gross. flag it because of the copyright. They just I thought, thought it was. They thought was, it was awful. I thought SoundCloud was a spot uh, and a place on this earth for people to put music and not have anyone listen to it or, or care about it. No, no. SoundCloud's pretty big, isn't it? Yeah, SoundCloud's huge. But I never get any music from there. I, always I just never put Spotify. any of mine on there either. Like I probably should. I figured out a great way to figure uh, to. To figure like, people out. See what music, you, it, like new music comes out that you would enjoy for sure because you can't always rely on Spotify's Discover Weekly. Sometimes they just feed you trash. It's, I don't know. They feed you stuff based on what you've been listening to, though. Yeah, and normally I listen to trash. Yeah, um, you do. You can rarely, if ever, uh, focus on New Music Friday. It's usually dog trash. That's usually the worst of the worst music. I haven't listened to New Music Friday, but it's the it's Discover Weekly that, like, mm -hmm. plays based on. There's your... Discover Weekly and there's uh, Release Radar. Release Radar? They have Release that? Radar. It's under like the same area. Those both have some good songs, but I mean, if yeah, you have like songs. long playlists of artists mm -hmm. and you want to keep up with them, all you have to do is just go back for, to a previous playlist. I've been going back to my 2016 playlist and going to each artist and seeing if they have new songs. Yeah, that's true. Oh, get over, cock! Oh, red car, bad face though. Jesus Christ. You know red cars are the most expensive in insurance color-wise? Yeah. Yeah, and coupes. Is it because cops are more likely to pull them over? It's considered a racing color. <laughs> a racist color. A racist color. Let's if you're see. red, I don't buy from you. Okay, we're turning. Bad salesman. I'm gonna. I'm going so sorry to film if the um. Right yeah, we're on our way to film tools. I'm so sorry if the camera is a little bit shaky this time because I don't have a GoPro. I need to eventually get one myself. I so, have. Hey. I told you you can have mine, but uh, James oh, yeah. is, James has my backpack in his car. Oh, Should we stop by James's that. place today? Yeah, we could get the GoPro. He's just in there doing heroin. I could see him uh, succumbing to a life of pain and drugs. Oh could yeah. Could you? Um, here's how I, here's what I see with James's future. This all starts to pick up. He finally creates a social media account. He gets a bunch of followers. He d he's never experienced this any uh, before oh. this. He doesn't. He's never had that oh. slow build up, oh. so he doesn't know how to deal with it all. True. It'll it come very head. fast for him. I hit a button. It gives his what really? I'm so sorry. Yeah. It gets his head physically bigger and uh, emotionally he becomes. Distant oh. to both his girlfriend and and the group. Yeah. Um, he picks up drug addiction because he real. can't keep up with his bits. Because they're so. Keep up with, oh, he needs so to, good, but oh. he, he realizes he needs. Oh Jesus! Uh, I'm so sorry, he needs everyone. Hardcore drugs to uh, to feed his bits, and then. He gets I always wondered how we're going to be able to keep it up, but I think that the way our brains are wired, we're always doing it anyways. Yeah, I mean, we, we never literally run were just doing poster stuff back there, and for 20 minutes, we were just talking and about really constantly. dumb things, yeah. Literally. So I don't know if we'll have issues with that. It's yeah. just uh, James will, because he's, I think he's Potential. he's weak. <laughs> no, I don't think that's James true. can't beat kidding. me in an arm wrestle. You can't, James. James could beat you in an arm wrestle. No, he couldn't. Oh, of course he could. Oh, turn the cold down. It's hurting my fingers. <laughs> Is it really? <laughs> They're frozen. I'm I think so... I'm getting frostbite. I'm so... Oh, he said I'm so horny. <laughs> Turn the cold down. I'm so Dude, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts. Please, 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 please. Okay, there you go, Jesus. Uh, I just feel so bad for everyone watching going, holy shit, this is giving me motion sickness. Is it really? Because the game is just uh, bouncing around. What you can do is warp stabilize it in After Effects, <sighs> but you can put it... But you can put it on no motion. Sorry I have countless information about... It's so hot now. Do you want me to put it back on? Yeah, maybe a little. Really? Yeah, maybe a little. Oh I've my instantly God. started sweating. This is... Well, I mean, how much longer is it going to be, do you think? Well, let's just sweat it out. Uh, well, yeah, we'll sweat it out. Oh, it hit me with a wave. So Look at that little spoiler. Where? Spoiler alert. <laughs> it's like that You guy. are so overheated right now to do <laughs> Can that. Can you see me sweating? Yikes. Boy, oh boy. So we're headed to Film Tools right now. <sighs> Film Tools is a great 
store. It's uh, one of the few stores in all of Los Angeles where you can find Don't nifty run. like equipment for filming. For Have instance, we been there? Or no, we went to like... You've never been there. No, You're going to love it. Um, I love film. Is there anything in particular you need that you could actually buy? Nope. Actually, I can bring my camera and be like, what is wrong with this? I just sent it in. Help me. No, they're not that kind of place. What is it? What do they do there? Um, is it's film equipment? Yeah, they have green screens, they have cameras, they have camera oh. equipment. There is just a an assortment. I'm sure they we could even look at like a the night vision shooting thing that they have. Yeah, I'm I think sure they we have need, I think we need some sort of stabilization rig that James could use. See, okay, the issue with that is that we do a lot of public shooting yeah. and oh, it would be it. risky to attract that much attention already. You're right. Yeah. I don't know when your video is coming out with this. Maybe tomorrow. Okay, so minus two. We should go in depth <gasps> about Yay. how you don't know how to read street signs. Listen, do you want to know what it really is? I understood, so we, I was driving to the Also, I'm looking the at wrong directions, address. by the way. I'm not looking at text or anything. They get so mad, dude. Uh, yeah, you see the amount of comments? Put your fucking phone down when you're driving. To be fair, we all we on the phones way too much while we drive. Yeah. Not on a bike. Definitely something I need to get better at, but I mean, for this ride only, I'm just on ways right now trying to figure out where we're going to film tools. So but, you'll yeah. see tomorrow Steve bullying me because we were all really like, I was super sick, so I wasn't really tolerating like I normally do. And uh, everyone else was just really grumpy. So I was being bullied yesterday because I didn't you know bullied. what road you were being I was on. Learned. I was You're being, being taught. Burn. I was being burnt. You were being uh, burn learned. You were having you yeah. were on burn notice. The it's other like day. teaching a kid not to do something by beating the shit out of them. Here's what happened. It was yesterday. Everyone was supposed to get to a warehouse to look it over to see if this is the place we should have our office. Uh, Ears. Already the scheduling was fucked up because for some reason Parker was in charge of it. And, I'll and that's kill you. he didn't fuck it up. I just he was texting in the chat the places we needed to be. And I'm like, uh, I don't want to look at the And Parker's did he put text. the actual correct address in? Yeah, he did. Good for him. Um, I just assumed it was going to be Jeremy. So we get to the place. He's paid to do that. He's just like yeah. our scheduler. So we get to the place. I'm at the wrong place. So I messaged Kip. I'm like, well, he know, he's coming to the same place I gave Kip. So this is my fucking fault that Kip is already on the way. So I'm like, okay, I'll just give him the new address. And pause. And I had recently run out of my data. So I had to put it in maps before there I left. There are so many little inconveniences. So there's that no to way you. that I could have changed it on my way. And it's LA traffic. I've only had my license for a couple months. Um, trying to be on the phone, talking to Steve, trying to drive in heavy traffic at like one o'clock in LA. But here's where everything- Looking for signs, don't know where road I'm on. It's a dark turn. It's not that dark of a turn. Oh, it's super dark because everybody that is above the age of 13 knows how to do this. Uh, Kip Maybe. doesn't know how to read street signs. And when I say that, I mean, I'm looking at an intersection right now. Obviously, I'm not at- Well, I know that that says that the right street is gate one. I do know that. I just didn't know how to see what road I was on at that moment. He's but. like five minutes to the right on Roscoe Boulevard, not even closest. Well, no, he's asking me, where am I right now? And I saw, I looked at the signs, I was like, okay, it says Roscoe and Sepulva. So it's just like, I think- Sepulva. I think I'm on Sativa. <laughs> Dude, we're on Lima Street, and I know that. No, we're not on Lima Street, we're on Olive all, all Avenue still. Cause you look to the- you're, I'm sorry, I got I got done. I got goofed. I got goofed. You goofed me, dude. Dude. So, I hate- What if my whole life is a giant goof on Steve and I'm actually like, Stephen Hawking. It's like, is it worth it though? Take for, me for too. What for you me, bring to the table. For me, for sure, definitely. I uh, bring so much to the table. Uh, I bring everything to the table. Jesus. Eggs, butter, <laughs> utensils. I've. I don't think I've ever been more like. I. I have no patience for anything else in my life right now. Because it's all used up. It's on all me. used on you. And I appreciate that, dude. God, I hate you. I love you. Dude. I love you, dude. I love. But you. I hate you. I hate you because you're. So good at so many things, but so Dude, bad why did this slide at so weird street me? things. <laughs> oh, that Pito Moss! Oh, was we like the most... food today. Oh, oh, we're gonna get free food. Yeah, no, we're gonna get free food. I so, well, I hope. First, let's talk about the video we did, which is today on Steven's channel. Ew, I called you Steven. I never called yeah, you Steven. Yeah, that was Steven. super weird. Did it sound weird? It did, yeah. It did, it's too it did. formal. It sounded weird. Steven. It's on Steve's channel. On Steven's channel. That's for your wife, and I guess people at SourceFed that called you that. Like, yeah, um, because they had to differentiate me from uh, the real Steve. <laughs> the real Steve. Oh, before we go into that video, we met Mike Falzone today. Well, I very you cool. Met you met Mike Falzone today. Yeah. I introduced Steve to Mike Falzone at Mike's place. Yeah, Mike's one of my best friends, and uh, it's tough not to see him as much. Lately. It was great to meet Mike. To <laughs> Meek Mills. It was great to meet Meek Mills. <laughs> it was great to oh, fight. Oh, go slower! It was great to fight Meek Mill what today. What are you doing? Oh, Jeep, Jesus. Jeep, Jeep, Jeep. Jeep, Jeep. Jeep's not going. Jeep, Jeep. No, that's just what my. That? 
That's my tech. <laughs> jeep, 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 jeep. <laughs> jeep, jeep, That jeep. person was the slowest driver I've ever seen. Dude, this for some reason, this podcast specifically because my hands are being frozen are taking me back to Toluca Lake Park. Really? <laughs> Car boys. We're also very close to Toluca Lake. That's probably why. Yeah. Dude, because Warner Bros. Was, but, <laughs> because Warner Brothers. Warner was Brothers like, is bad. I sometimes feel like I'm becoming my dad because he does the slurring thing too, and he's not like drunk. Really? Or even buzzed or anything. He my just, dad's incredibly coherent and better than your dad. <laughs> Dude, my, my dad, dad was a bodybuilder. My dad could beat the shit out of your dad. My dad was a bodybuilder. It took so long for my parents to understand the difference between what I do and what's actually real. So it took so long for my parents to be able to speak. <laughs> <laughs> what are, they, are they actually selling just sheepskin? Where? Oh, it's clothing. Oh Dash my god. I thought they were actually just selling just straight up sheepskin. Did sheep you think skin. that that, perp, that pink... That pink thing hanging there was a sheepskin? No, it says sheepskin. Where? Right there. Where? Right there, next to dash cover keys. Look to the oh, right of it. Oh, cheapskin. It says sheepskin. Yeah, you're right. There's an S behind the sign. Discount cigarettes. Where are we? <laughs> discount. That's literally what the sign says. Next to psychic mystical shop. Honestly? I hate to look I need a discount on cigarettes now. <laughs> Uh, Otherwise, I can't continue these habits. If you ever wanted to see what it's like for us to talk to each other when we're not doing bits, <laughs> that was it. The passing of information takes so long for something so simple. I think we have a weird miscommunication thing because, like, you'll start explaining something. I'm like, yeah, no, I know that, I know that, but there's this is what I'm trying to figure out. And then for some reason, you aren't able to like process what I'm actually trying to figure out and tell me what I already know. You just keep fucking feeding me what I already know and not telling me what I need to know. There's so, like, that's it every single time. There's one thing and it's so and funny. And for some reason, James is able to fully understand you, but Parker isn't. Everyone can understand me. We have a communication issue. Maybe we should kiss. No, I think we, maybe we should, do. we should go to counseling. Couples we should actually, therapy do they have, for a video. Do they have friends counseling? No, couples therapy. Couples therapy? That'd be really funny. That'd be really funny. Yeah, it would. Be. Okay, let's do it. That'd be really funny. I'm down. Oh, but no, right they, they're gonna ask us to do weird things with each other. No, only butt stuff. Oh, and that's fine. That's not that weird. Alright. The video trying. we did on your channel that will be live tomorrow, which is today for the watchers, is... Today for the watchers is the I Justine video. Oh, we didn't even talk about the fire festival. God damn well, it. Well, let's talk about the fire festival. We're not there yet, are we? We're actually right there. Talk about the fire festival, go. Fire, fire festival. festival. Uh, if you haven't heard about it, it's basically a Coachella thing on some island that uh, Ja Rule promoted. How much did it cost? $10,000 to get out there per for person. a VIP ticket. VIP. Yeah. And they get out there, it's basically, it looks like a refugee camp. Um, and yeah, that was the spoiler. Yeah, so everybody's getting their shit stolen. Um, people that are coming in on planes have to be like rerouted because uh, the US embassy is involved. It's a huge issue right now. And, and where are people getting robbed? But like, here's the thing, everybody's like that? laughing at all these people that spend their money because they're like, oh, no, I'm a I, don't, I still don't think it's funny. Honestly, it's not Definitely that funny. Not funny. It's, it's kind of annoying. For like, anyone to are, go through anything troublesome, Sucks. Yeah, it is. Doesn't it's mean like, I care. People are going out there to have a good time. Yeah. Maybe they're spending their parents' money. Maybe they're spending trust fund money. It's like may or not be. It sorry, not be. sorry that they're privileged. <laughs> Come on. I wish it was me. Yeah, true. I do wish it was me. And I wonder if that. Well, no, I don't wish it was me now. No, if you okay, this is the the situation. If it could be you, sorry, if you could be a trust fund kid with a lot of money, but you had to be there right now, and stuck there. But you get to be bad, no, you get to come I, back, I actually but don't then think... forever you have a shit ton of money. No, because I really like what I have going on right now, and I feel like if I was a trust fund kid, I would sure. not be able to actually, like, this girl's persevere. Just huh? I hated to, I oh, hate to interview God. you, but... Oh, she's walking away now. Oh, thank God. That, that would have been Do you want to hang out later? Or tonight? Um, later? I don't like the idea of being a trust fund kid because I think all of my motivation would, would go away. I mean, every time I complete yeah, a video be, game and I cheat in it... You'd just be instantly content and yeah. be fine with like, chilling. I'll give myself unlimited money in GTA and I have, like, I have no drive to play the right, game. Right, exactly! Dude, that's exactly me with anything. Yeah, I think that's how that works. You, it's the chase that's important. And it's oh, a very good you're sick day and you have to be a car boy. I'm not that sick anymore. Yeah, that's cool. Thank you for coming out to car boys. I don't know if it was too short, but I think it was full of combo. And I'm so sorry about the camera being shaky. I promise it won't happen again. It possibly might if I forget the camera. Thank you for you. Any last any last words? No, I'm set. Tell them where to follow you. Oh, just link in the description. Bad promo. Bad promo. Car.